how to find your maths folder. In today's video, we are going to learn how to find your maths. If you don't seem to find it on your PC, on your Mac, on Windows, on iMac. So the first thing that I want you to do is to open up your PC where all of your files are located. Then select the documents folder. And then if you see the electronic arts folder, double click on it, go into the Sims 4 and then there should be a mods folder. Now, warning, if there is not a singular mods folder inside, I will have to skip this step so that you know how to actually have a mods folder. But now we are trying to identify it. This is the only location where your mods folder should appear. If it isn't there, then we can do a little trick onto your taskbar you might notice the search bar right it is available both on mac and windows type into that taskbar mods if any folder shows up that basically has the same name you can right click on it open file location and see where it's located then you can go back okay click on this little arrow right click on it copy go to the main location where it should have been in the first place which is documents electronic cards the sims 4 paste it another trick that you can do in order to identify your mods folder is checking your recycle bin because you might have deleted it by accident so it might be there if that's not the case then i suggest we move on to generating a new mods folder so that you can actually use all of your mods so the first step into doing this is opening up the game make sure you don't have the legacy game because as far as i know the legacy game version no longer exists so if you had that one that is not compatible with the mods folder okay so we need to switch to the normal version if you're still onto Origin, it does work, but onto the EA app, you cannot switch the versions. It needs to be a 64-bit version because the Legacy Edition is a 32-bit. So I'm going to insert a little clip on how you can switch to 64, which is the normal version, if you are, again, using the Origin app, which is only available onto Mac. But now, we need to open up the game. We need to go to Game Options, Other and enable script mods as well as as well as custom content make sure both of these two boxes are ticked apply changes exit the game we are going to reopen it via the same app which is ea or origin so we're gonna reopen the game go to game options again other make sure that those options did stay enabled and by the way, if those didn't stay enabled, I have a video that walks you through how you can fix that. But if those two did stay enabled, we can exit the game, go into documents, electronic cards, the Sims 4, and then there should be your mods folder. Now, if it doesn't appear, this is the easy solution, okay? If it doesn't appear and we are still facing difficulties, the ultimate solution that I have for everything, and I mean everything, whenever it comes to game issues, glitches, you know, folders not showing up, your saves folder not being in the right place, or your mods folder not being there, is resetting the EA folder. That means that our current folder is going to be a backup, okay? We're going to keep it as a backup by renaming it. So I want you to go into your documents folder once again, right click and type in old next to electronic arts okay i like to call it old because that way i know that i no longer use it you can call it you know backup as well once you do this the game will no longer recognize this folder okay which is not a bad thing because we are about to put all of our saves all of our files back but you need to keep this folder in place do not delete it because this is a backup this contains all of your saves all of your mods all of your houses so leave it right there now i want you to check if you have enough free space as well okay you can go onto your pc or onto your system if you're on mac it is optimal to have 
around 30 to 40 gigabytes if you are using a lot of CC. But if you're not using a lot of CC, it's best to be in a blue line. If you are not in a blue line, I also have lots of videos talking about how you can deal with lag, how you can reduce lag, how you can clean up your PC so that it works faster. So make sure you check that out as well. Once we've made sure that we have enough free space, we can open up the game. And I am warning you at first, you will see that there is nothing in your game. No worries, we're gonna fix it in a second. We're gonna put all of our files back because all of our files are in the backup folder. Close the game and then go back into your EA alt, the Sims 4 and then the saves folder. Hit Command A if you are on a Mac or Control A to select all of your files. Right click on them, copy, and now we're gonna go back, back, back until you see the new Electronic Arts folder, okay? Because the new folder has been generated when we did open that game. Go into the new Electronic Arts folder, The Sims 4, and then Saves. Paste, right click and paste all of your saves. And the same thing we're going to do for our tray, screenshots, as well as mods. So we're going to go back into the EA Old, The Sims 4, Tray. This tray folder contains all of our lots, all of our houses, everything we've saved in the gallery, in the library. So go to the new Electronic Arts folder, The Sims 4, Tray. Okay, we're going to paste them into the same folder right click and then paste now we're gonna do the very same thing for the screenshots i'm gonna speed it up a little bit we're gonna copy the screenshots and paste them into our new screenshots folder and the same thing goes for our mods now you can notice that the new electronic arts folder does contain a mods folder okay so this is what we wanted this is a fix that we have been wanting for so long. We finally have a mods folder. In case you still need to find it, there might be one in your OneDrive folder, okay? If you're using backing up, you can access your OneDrive and then go there into the documents, electronic cards, The Sims 4, and see if there is any mods folder. You can copy and paste it from there into your regular documents, electronic cards, The Sims 4 folder. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.